Uh, wait a minute. I think I know what it wants me to do. Yes, I drag this so that the sunlight hits it. Yes. There we go. Oh, what the hell? Hmm. Ah, oh, can I move this? I wonder. No, I was hoping I could move it. Oh, actually, wait. No, <laughs> I was hoping I could do that. So basically, I can get up there. I just need... I'd need something to climb on. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, actually, wait a minute. I've just realised this is broken. Yeah, I can use this to get up top. I don't need to move a ledge. Yeah, I just do that and then jump and glide. Whoop. Hooray! It was that simple. I just overthought it. Aha! There's the sundial. Woo! Oh no! Ooh, I almost fucked up. So I can pick it up. Ooh! Oh, right, I'm actually using it. I can't use it as a weapon. That's a shame. We, Yeah, I almost dropped all the way down. Which would have fucking sucked. Because I would have had to go through all of what I just did. Ooh. I got lucky. There it is. We did it. Oh. It just opened straight up. Oh, we're back in here. Ah, I see. Now that's short. Uh, okay. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, there it is. Boom. Hmm. So I know there was another passage on this side, so if I just move this to face that instead. Okay. One thing I do need is health. I need to do this. Yep. <laughs> Hello. Very nice. Oh yeah, for some reason I, could th I thought I could shift straight away. I'm an idiot. Oh. Well, I see... I believe... It looks like a Soul Reaver thing on the floor. Okay. How do you do, fellas? Just running around using it. Yeah, yeah! Oh, it doesn't seem to kill them all that quick. You have to do, like, focused attacks. Oh no, it seems if you just hit them four times it kills them. Alright. Yeah, I see the Soul Reaver icon. Up above. There it is. Oops. I see a weapon. And so, of course... Oh. Oh, I thought there'd be enemies. Alright. I mean, if there isn't, there isn't. Hmm. I don't see any enemies. Oh, fuck. Why is the heavy with this? Holy crap. That was incredible. That was really cool. I mean, it's, it's got the same moveset as the axe. Not, so, not sure why I'm surprised. Maha! Am 
Oh no, you don't. And dead. <laughs> like how easily they just fall apart. It's like they're made of paper. Ah, okay. I see. Oh, there you go. Where's the other one? No, no, you don't. Stop ducking, dickbag. I was going to say, I don't even care about the soul at this point. Oh, it seems the soul actually sticks around. It doesn't just despawn. Interesting. Hmm. So if I just move this... ...to face me... Hmm. Wait a minute, what is that? Wait a minute. Oh! Shoot. I do need to do this. It's the same as before. Boom. Now it opens up. I want it. Hang on a minute. I'm just like, what have I missed? There's clearly something that's that I've missed. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Oh god. Ah. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I see. Yeah, I didn't realize I could move this. My bad. Eh, there we go. What am I gonna do? Oh! Am I gonna make, like, a weird bridge? That's a tiny thing to land on. Are you kidding? Oh my god, it's a bridge. Ugh. What the hell is this? I can't see. Whoosh! There we go. Hooray! I made... I made it. Oh. Alright, so we have... this one. The only one that's got something, or at least what looked like it has something behind it was, yeah, this. So I'll move this two times. And again. What the hell? Oh, we got it. So I should just be able to crouch. Up. Are you kidding? Ah, oh, I wasn't close enough, no wonder. Oh, there we go. Oh, what the... What? What the hell? Oh, it was a sundial. <laughs> I thought it was like a weird crystal. Oh my god, I'm crazy. So if I... Okay. There we go. Aha! There we go. Oh. Oh my god. The m not music. It's like the chant. Oh, we're locked in. Ah, uh, okay. We can only get out with a certain reaver. Spoilers. What? No. <laughs> Jeez. Alrighty. As I neared the altar, I suddenly felt the Reaver quickening of its own volition. Just as in William's Chapel, the balance of power tangibly shifted. Voracious and willful, the Soul Reaver was now in control, and I merely its helpless puppet. Whoa. The Reaver plunged itself into that mysterious altar, and devouring the energy that emanated from within, 
drained this place of its power. Thus sated, the Reaver released me. And I realized as I recovered control that these ancient shrines were forges, each purpose built to enhance the Reaver with elemental power. Mm-hmm. We now have an elemental Reaver. Oh, a dark Reaver. And as you can see, we now have more health. So that's why our health is lowered. I don't know if it means the the Reaver will no longer feed on me. It more than likely still will. Hmm. Now I understood the purpose of the mysterious basins I had seen throughout my journey. They were elemental fonts, each attuned to a fundamental essence. When I forged the blade, every font in Nosgoth with the same elemental attunement was simultaneously quickened. The Reaver's enhancements were never permanent, but these fonts enabled me to re-imbue the blade by bathing it in the elemental energy distilled therein. Hmm. Yeah, there we go. So if I got rid of the Reaver and then reactivated it... Oh no, it still is dark. It might just be if you lose it altogether. Not entirely sure. Alright, all I have to do is retrace my steps. Concentric circles, one eclipsing the other. I recognized this symbol from the door sealing that other ancient shrine, the one I had seen in the lake outside the Saraphan stronghold. Yep. Perhaps now, armed as I was with the elemental power of darkness, I could return and gain entry. Uh huh. Oops. Let's see. Whoa. I was wondering why the hell it was flashing so much. Do -do -do. I'd rather not have to fight anything if I don't need to. Nope. Spit at me all you wish. I do not care. Wait, what? Oh, I took a wrong turn. Whoops. My bad. Very well. And I think the bottom left is to tell you what element it currently is. I don't know if you can switch it. Probably not. I can now open this. I could open that anyway. Ooh. You're a ragged excuse for a savior. Vorador. God, he looks so different. reputation precedes me. It does. All good, I hope. I've been watching you since you emerged from that accursed stronghold. Strange that your arrival coincides with the corruption of the pillars. But I'm wondering, are you the catalyst of these events? Or the answer to them? I don't know what you mean. I will speak plainly then. I distrust your origins, stranger. Seeing you crawl from the putrid depths of Mobius's keep makes me question your purpose here. And what should I make of your appearance? Not human, clearly, and more demon than vampire. And the pillars. It is no mere coincidence that your arrival in that clearing heralded the pillars' decay. And so I ask you plainly. Are you the instrument of the Pillar's destruction, or their salvation? Neither. Very well. Let us look at the other side of the coin. I have followed your journey and watched as you blithely unlocked secrets that have been sealed and forbidden for thousands of years. The path you have been treading is open to only one being. You don't know what you are, do you? I have been many things. If you find me ignorant, enlighten me. <laughs> <laughs> What's the point? This world is beyond redemption. Let the human cattle have it. I would expect better than meek capitulation from you. 
Centuries of persecution have taught me well. 500 years ago, our race was nearly exterminated by the fanatical crusades of the Seraphim. And now the same sick drama unfolds again. In merely a decade, Mobius's cutthroat citizen army has nearly accomplished what the Seraphim could not. Vampires meddling in the affairs of men. Look where it's brought us. What am I to make of these secrets I've uncovered then? The depictions of the winged race, the pillars and the reaver. Fairy tales, boy. The delusions of an ancient culture clinging to hope long after the world had discarded them. Their bloodline trickled away until only one of the ancients remained, sustained solely by obligation and his unfaltering faith in the old prophecies. But you see, even if you are who you appear to be, it no longer matters. You're simply too late. Janos Audrin, the Reaver Guardian, the last of the Ancients, and my maker, was murdered by the Seraphim nearly five centuries ago. He alone would have the answers you seek, but his secrets died with him. I don't know how you've come even this far without his guidance, or without the Reaver, stolen these 500 years ago by the Seraphim. I'm afraid, my friend, that you and all of us are out of luck. Hmm. Oh. I had no less reason to trust Vorador than anyone else I had met. In fact, the ancient vampire was the most forthright being I had encountered thus far. If Janos Ordren was the key to all this, then I would find him, and Mobius's time-streaming device would provide me passage. But first, I had to find a way back into the stronghold, and I suspected I would find the means within the lake's mysterious shrine. Mm-hmm. Aye, okay. I was gonna say something, but I've completely forgotten. <laughs> yep, forgot what it was. One thing that occurred to me though is, I don't know how this is even possible, given the fact this came out earlier, but this game seems to be more detailed than Blood Omen 2, which came out a year after this. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, it just seems a lot more detailed, mostly from Vorador's, um, not perspective. Mostly in terms of Vorador. Oh, fuck. Oh god, she exploded. Yeah, because... I don't know. Vorador just looks a lot more detailed. Like, with the cat-like eyes. Um, and, like, his clothes and everything, whereas in Blood Omen 2, his design was incredibly... Basic? Kinda. Like, his eyes didn't have any sort of detail to them, they were just kind of, like, yellow. Or gold. Whatever you want to say. It's very strange. I think I'm actually going to do this in the spectral realm. Going through water is a lot easier that way. There we go. I'm already down here! Oh. But it doesn't matter anyway. If I shift back to the material plane, the water will just materialize around me, so it's all good. Boom, boom, boom. It's just strange because I'm pretty sure Blood Omen 2 came out a year after this. Unless, I don't know, maybe there were some complications with it or something. Is this the uh, Elder God? Maybe? Oh, no, 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 I know where we are. But from here, I'm pretty sure I need to just swim straight up. Mm hmm. And we're in water. I'm pretty sure I just go straight up, don't I? Where am I? Oh, right here. 
right, yeah, yeah. I know where we are. I've completely forgotten. Now I have to go back through this place. If I can just avoid the shed, I would prefer to. I just don't want to fight them. Although they do have ranged attacks. So I should maybe be careful. Right, so... No, it's still dark. Hmm. Weird. Yeah, I don't care. Bye-bye! Oh, Can't remember if this is where I need to be. Pretty sure. It definitely is. Alright, just keep on doing the dash. Oh, we're back! Hey! Hmm? Come on. I'm quite surprised the Elder God doesn't have anything to say. Oh, he does. Ah, my wayward child returns. Having unearthed more than you'd like, I suspect. What am I to make of these ruins that litter the land and these images here in this chamber? Merely the deceits of a failed civilization. You are being misled, Raziel. This ancient race hoped to manipulate the future with these scrawled misdirections. You must tread carefully. There are dark forces at work in this world, bent on subverting your true destiny. I have no doubt of that. The question is, am I in their presence right now? Your arrogance will spell your demise, Raziel. Deny my will, and the arc of your destiny will reach a sudden conclusion. Your threats are unmoving. Even now, I'm beyond your reach. Mm. My reach is longer than you realize. This is a very dangerous game you're playing, Raziel. Okay. Interesting. Very weird. Wait, where did I come from? Was it there, or...? No, oh, it must have been there. Yeah, sure. I would save, but I don't really need to. No, I'll save when I'm just around the corner from where I need to go next. And I think I might end the session. Well, we're just over two hours. Well, we probably will be. Yeah, here we go. Whew. Oh, God. I was going to say, I'm not sure what the better thing to do here is. Avoiding them, I think. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. Aha. Oh, dear. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I realised that may have been a mistake. And I realised it a bit too late. Oh, here we go. What the? For a second, I thought that was homing in on me. No, let me through. There we go. Not too bad. Did one of the dungeons. Apparently, I'm pretty sure this game's actually shorter than the first game. But it all really depends on how much of an idiot I am. Yeah. And I don't really know if there's much in terms of, like, boss fights or anything. Or if this is mostly just gonna flesh out the story and then Defiance is where it'll, like... Well, I know Defiance is where it comes to a close. I know it's just strange that there was no sort of boss fight, it was literally just puzzles, kinda. God, it's so silent. It's very weird. Are there no hunters? Oh yeah, we need to go back to the pillars. Yeah, I'd forgotten. Is there not gonna be another cutscene? With Kane? I guess not. I'll take it. Hmm. I don't know if there's going to be any hunters. Uh, of course. Well, yep. Fuck. I was going to say I'd rather get another a regular kill. Oh shit! Yeah. You bitch! You double bitch! 
Triple bitch. I can kick him. Oh my god. I'm really bad at fighting. I want to kick. I want to kick him. Oh my god, that was a one hell of a leap. What am I doing? Aside from just fucking up. Oh! Oh god, the dog. Ah, the dog. Fucking dog. Wow. I wanted to do that. Whoosh, whoosh. Can I just get the soul so I get health? Please. Quickly. Thank you. See, I just seem to be better at dodging these guys than the chicks with the fucking axes. He says and then gets hit repeatedly. Whatever. I suppose the plus side of humans is you don't have to worry about taking the weapon out of them. How will that work? I just realised. I am curious. With the vampires. I'm just curious of taking the weapon out of them and going from there. So the colour of these must indicate the element? Is that water? What's blue usually associated with? Blue is usually... It's kind of like a teal. So, if I had to guess, it's either water or air. Right? I think that's a pretty safe bet. Nice. Water or air. That's dark, clearly. Um... I'm just thinking of the others. Oh, fuck. Another dog died. Good stuff. Boom. He ended. Arsehole. What is happening? Wait, can I knock off his head? Oh, he died. He just kind of bled out. Get out of here. Oh, oh. I didn't die. Fuck. Whoops. Boom. Uh, I think that's it. Where am I going? Oh, this is where I came in. That's right. So going this way should lead to a save. And I shouldn't be too far away from... Um... Oh, shit. No, I, I shouldn't be too far away from where I need to be anyway. I just need to swim a little bit, I think. Oh! Owned. Double owned. I wish there was more than just the one execution. Yeah, it's just a bit lame, but whatever. The hell? Oh, the birds. Yeah, th that's what I was going to say. God, it took me long enough to realise. No, I think the birds must be to do with Vorador. Well, they make a green glow when they disappear. And Vorador did the exact same. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. And then I just instantly lost my track train of thought. It happens a bit too much. Are you fucking... Oh, okay. Dick. Owned! Yeah, please die. Thank you. Full health. I don't know if healing... Uh, healing. If saving fully heals or not. I would guess it maybe does. I've got a few more douchebags to deal with. Oh, okay. Why did he jump? Very random. I'm just glad they gave the guy with the gun less health than normal. Makes dealing with him a lot easier. That was just lucky. Absolutely. Yeah! Raziel doesn't discriminate. Man or woman, they're gonna be headless. Wow, this actually is a lot longer. Like this path leading to the save point. Oh, shit. How the fuck did that work? Are you crazy? Great, no, I'm not going to be able to get a hit in. What? This is bullshit. My attacks are just completely missing. The one I was locked on one on didn't even get knocked down. I'm very confused. <laughs> oh, what the hell happened? No! Get out of here. You missed. Ha! I wasn't even locked on. Whoops. Oh yeah!
I actually don't mind this controller. The only thing I don't like is the D-pad. Or oh, D-pad down. Because it's incredibly loud. I don't know how audible it is, but... Uh, you can't hear it on stream. It picks up on my, like, normal mic track. Maybe my, uh, noise gate gets rid of that. Oh! Fuck. Maybe. Fingers crossed. Uh... Yeah, I'll just do this. This is where the save point is. Pretty sure. Ooh! Oh! So that would be fire, I would guess. Uh, okay. So you've got the f a fire reaver, dark reaver, air slash water reaver, and I don't know about the other. Wait, are these all? Oh no, I thought each of these... Maybe they do. No, they don't. You've got red and yellow. Alright, never mind. I'm just looking for symbolism where it doesn't exist. Override. And there we go. That's going to be the end of this first session. Not too bad, really. Yeah. Yeah. I made a fair bit of progress and got through the first, um, forge. So I'd say we're making pretty good progress. Like I care, you know. <laughs> as long as I'm getting through the game, that's all that really matters. Regardless, that is going to be the... Huh? Okay, that was weird, but yeah. Regardless, that's going to be the end of this session. Thanks so much for watching, I hope you have enjoyed, and until next time, take care.